It's October 2nd. I guess you could call it the third day of harvest. We've just kind of had a little days to uh, make sure everything's working. And uh, I'm running the cart right now, obviously. I've been running the combine the last couple afternoons, but... Uh, Got the drone with us. And I want to try that out. So, about to set in and I'm going to quick take off and see how that is. Now it's October 3rd. I'm just getting out here. I worked last night and thought I'd be able to get up earlier, but uh, it just couldn't. I was just too exhausted from the week. My body wouldn't let me wake up after an hour of sleep. So we're out here now, though. There's the cart. And the combine just went over that hill in the center. You'll have to take my word for it. But uh, we're just opening up another field. I saw them as I got in the area, and there was a semi parked in the field they just finished. Half full. We've uh, made our way to the combine. You can tell we're in the middle of the cornfield right now. I just got the headlands finished. I like to split the fields so that I can turn and not have to turn back on the rows that I just did. And then it always keeps it where my auger is facing somewhere that I can unload on the go and I'm not stuck only being able to unload one way down the field just for efficiency reasons. Um, yeah, you can see the trucks up to the right there turning around. Uh, the cart's rolling up to him. We're starting to get in a pretty good groove. It's a Saturday, and we got uh, plenty of guys out here, which is a good change, because the weekdays just kind of struggle with everyone having their other jobs, but uh, we're rocking. rocking and rolling. We're still going four mile an hour. You know, it goes pretty good at five mile an hour. I just slowed down a little bit. Um, I've caught the dryer, but we've only got about two acres or less left. So I'm just waiting for a truck. So there's no sense to hurry. So um, chugging along, not much, well, not, no video this afternoon. Uh, my wife was riding with me. So I would worked all week and she did too, a few of the days. So we hadn't seen each other much. So we just uh, caught up from the week and then uh, I'm pretty hungry because all I had was two uh, little homemade egg in a muffin tin thing uh, for breakfast and it's nine o'clock at night so uh, I'm ready to call it a night. Granted I didn't wake up till uh, 11 a.m. 
so which I got to bed at 7 a.m. so that's besides the point but I'm hungry so I'm ready to be done and go home for the night. I'm gonna make my way over to the grain cart on the other side of a little uh, ditch crossing. Now it's going dark but we're just gonna go start that up get it ready for when the semi pulls in. We're just rolling back in it's 10 p.m. got her all done. The dryer is still steaming away so we got the system packed full though. So probably run all day tomorrow, Sunday. We'll go to church and probably take the day off to be with family because we'll let the dryer run and we might be thinking about switching to beans Monday. Yeah, just a quick rough video. Uh, I know a lot of the clips don't flow together well. Just a quick drone shot. Um, I'm gonna get a little better with it. It was hard to drive and uh, fly at the same time. I'm talking driving uh, equipment plus flying the drone. So. I'm gonna get better at that, more footage of that. Um, pulling in the garage here without taking my mirror off. Um, probably some beans this coming week. So with that, you guys have a good one. Be safe as always. Check you later.